gasoline. Gasoline. To complain. A two-handed form of the sign, complain, meaning to complain and complain. To complain and complain. It's terrible. My girlfriend, Pam, lives in California. She complains and complains about the gasoline problem. One time, she and her husband got up early in the morning at 5.30. a form of the sign time, which means a time when something is scheduled to happen. A time when something is scheduled to happen. You have seen this hand shape used to represent a vehicle such as a car. Here is how you show cars lined up side by side. Here is how you show cars lined up end to end cars lined up end to end. If they don't get up early in the morning, there will be a big line of cars. When it was time to open, there were cars lined up, altogether 60 of them. Janine will now explain that a car was sixth in a line of cars. Sixth in a line of cars. It was lucky she was sixth. She asked me, does Indiana have a gas problem? Here we have a direct quote. First you say who is speaking and then what they said. So the speaker is Janine and she points to herself and then she quotes herself as saying, not yet, but there is a problem with rain. <coughs> to rain, to rain and rain and rain. To rain and rain and rain. It rained and rained and rained for three days. It was terrible. The water was rising. Poor people, their homes were damaged. One city, imagine, downtown the water rose 10 feet and spoiled everything. My home, there was no problem. I'm sick of one thing. My son was excited to see the water and the mud.
boots. In many parts of the country, this sign means electricity. My son asked me, can I use boots and play outside? And I said, okay. In the context of talking about boots and playing outside, the following means putting on the boots. Putting on boots. He ran and got the boots and put them on. There are two ways to sign putting on clothes. First, or, to put on clothes. Or, a demonstration of moving toward a surface and then sliding horizontally across it. Moving toward a surface and then sliding horizontally across it. I put old clothes on him. The context of the story tells you that it was on him rather than on her. Why? He will slide into the mud. Something about this thick. All over your body. Something about so thick covering your body. He had mud about this thick all over him. He loves to play in the mud. The boy went out. Later I went to the window and looked. Sure enough, he was running and sliding into the mud and playing and playing. to look at something. In the story, Janine shows her reaction to what she saw by using facial expression. She seems to be disappointed and disgusted by what she has seen. I looked, oh, he, oh well, he's happy. I shouldn't complain. The first two signs were finish and play. They do not mean he finished playing. Because of the facial expression, it means when he finished playing, the boy entered the house. He stood and waited. There was a square area of tile. He stood on it and hollered, Mom, come on. To take off somebody's clothes. To take off somebody's clothes. Bath. Bath.
I went to him and took off his clothes, brought him for a bath, washed him. He was clean. Gasoline. To complain and complain and complain. A time when something is scheduled to happen. Cars lined up end to end. Rain and rain and rain. Boots or electricity. To put on boots. To put on clothes. To put on clothes. To slide horizontally across a surface. To take off someone's clothes. Bath. 